A good day for a road, a road race, depending on where you were. There have been spots where it was not so kind to the runners, I'm sure, and the reporters, too. Bob happened to be in a dry location today. Uh, 78 was our high at Pittsburgh International, 58 the low. That puts us 7 degrees above the averages of 72 and 50. And right now, as you take a look at the uh, Pirates-Padres game in the background, we're not far off of our high for the day, 76 degrees, with a partly cloudy sky at Pittsburgh International. You'd never know that we have all these showers and scattered storms in the region, because at the moment, at least, at the airport, where this record is kept and official records are kept and readings, things are pretty sweet at the moment. Humidity is high though, so it's sticky out there. Winds out of the south at 10 and the pressure is just under 30 inches of mercury. Temperatures ranging widely depending on who's seen rain and when. Out in Bedford and Johnstown, they're only in the upper 50s right now, but we've got Pittsburgh and Beaver Falls and Wheeling all at six or 76 degrees. There are hot spots. Everybody else is in between. And the reason why is the pockmark precipitation that we're seeing region right now, particularly heavy in parts of Westmoreland and Indiana County, although the warning that had been issued for those counties in this region right here has expired. That was as of two minutes ago. We'll keep you posted should that warning be reissued. There is still, as you can see, a fairly good sized storm moving through that region up into central parts of Indiana County in the, in the next half hour. So be on the lookout for that. And there are more showers out there and will be more to come overnight and early tomorrow. Then I think by 9 or 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, things go quiet and we stay gorgeous on Sunday and almost all day Monday, Monday until about 6 o'clock at night. And then I think we'll see a shower or two move in. And by early Monday morning, we'll have anywhere from a tenth to a quarter to in some locations even a half of an inch of rainfall but that's between now and early Monday morning forecast says 64 degrees tonight with showers isolated storm or two we'll keep you posted should any severe weather crop up but right now there are no watches or warnings out there mostly cloudy with morning showers around tomorrow should be out of here by 10 a.m. on our way to what will be a partly cloudy muggy day be prepared for that and then I think we get back into the storminess on Monday and Tuesday, Paul. Both days, mostly cloudy with showers and storms possible any time. Then good weather hits town, and I mean hits and sticks, with readings running in the upper 70s to low 80s from Wednesday right through Saturday and into early Sunday too. Paul?